Okay, example 4. The probability distribution of a discrete random variable x is given by this table here. Alright, so we have x is 0, 1, 2 and the, and the corresponding probability is a, b and c. Alright, so the question is if expected value of x is 1.1 and the variance of x is 0 0.54, find the constant a, b and c. Alright, so for this question, we want to find the value of a, b and c. Alright, so we can use all the information that given here. So the first information that we have is we know that the expected value of x is 1.1. So we can use this maybe to find the value of a, b, and c. So the expected value of x is 0 times a plus 1 times b plus 2 times c is equals to 1.1. And this is equals to, okay, 0 times a is 0, and 1 times b is b plus 2c is equals to 1.1. Right, so from here, we cannot solve this because we still have two unknown here, B and C. So, uh, we cannot solve from here. So, we let this as a first equation. Maybe from the second equation, we can solve this. Alright, so from the variant of X, so we know variant of X is given 0 0.54. So, if we calculate, if we calculate the value of x, we should get 0 0.54. Alright, so value of x is e x squared minus e x squared. Okay, is equals to 0 0.54. And we know the value for the expected value of x, which is 1.1. So e x squared is equals to 0 0.54. Alright, so that's mean, so e x square minus k okay, 1.1 squared is equals to, to 1.21 equals to 0 0.54. So e x square is equals to 1.75. Alright, so we can find, uh, we can try to calculate back e x squared. So to find e x square, this is uh, 0 squared times a plus 1 squared times b plus 2 squared times c is equals to 1.75. So this is equals to b plus 4c is equals to 1.75. Alright, so now we have these two equations. So we can solve these two equations simultaneously to find the value of b and c. Okay, you can use substitution method or you can use elimination method. So for this question, I will use the elimination method. So I will take the second equation and then minus it with this first equation. All right, so second equation is b plus 4c equals to 1.75. Minus the first equation is b plus 2c is equals to 1.1. So we just subtract these two equations. Okay, so b minus b is 0. For c minus 2c is 2c. 1.75 minus 1.1. This is equals to 0 0.65. Alright, so we get the value of c. c is 0 0.325. So we get the value of C. So when we have the value of C, we can substitute back. We can substitute C equals to 0 0.325 into the first or the second equation. So I choose to substitute into the first equation. So I will get uh, B plus 2 times C. C is 0 0.325 is equals to 1.1 so b plus k okay, 2 times 0 0.325 is 0 0.65 so b is equals to 0 0.45 so now we already have the value of b and c and so we still need to find the value of a so how do we find the value of a 
Alright, so we know that the summation of all the probability of x is equals to 1. So that means a plus b plus c should equals to 1. So we already know the value of b and c, so we can substitute here. So a plus b, b is 0 0.45 and c is 0 0.325 is equals to 1. Alright, so if we solve this, we get a is equals to 0 0.225. So we get all the value that we want, which is a is 0 0.225, b is equals to 0 0.45 and C is equals to 0 0.325.